If I was to impose a new one world order, this is how I would do it. I would do it in the year 2020, mainly for astrological reasons. See my video, 2020 Apocalypse, A New Horizon. I would implement this reordering of the world in three phases over 12 to 18 months. The three-phase plan. Phase one, reset the world financial system. I would replace the current fiat world currencies with a new unified gold-backed one world currency. The strategy. One, I would need a scapegoat and trigger to blame for the crashing of the current fiat system. Two, I would need to maintain as much law and order during the transition. Three, I would need to ensure that the masses are willing to accept this change, better yet, even grateful for it. Now, there is only one thing that can ensure and facilitate such a plan. A worldwide contagious virus of epidemic proportions, like the coronavirus, for instance. Such a virus would allow me to enforce mass public quarantine all over the earth, which would in turn drastically disrupt the world's socio-economic system. Such a disruption would quickly collapse the already fragile fiat world economy. This virus would be the perfect scapegoat for why the world financial system collapsed. The quarantine would ensure that the public masses are contained within their homes during the collapse. This would limit the likelihood of mass protests, riots, looting and general public chaos. With enough fear and anxiety already fueled by the virus, the public would be subdued, confused and desperate enough to accept or better yet demand that their governments quickly resolve the crisis. Whilst the world is in quarantine without any functioning socio-economic system, all the world governments would seemingly quickly get together to come up with a rescue plan. Problem, reaction, solution. Of course, the rescue plan would predominantly include the following. Mass vaccinations all over the world to combat the virus. And soon after, nano microchips to track and monitor people's health, just in case this catastrophic virus returns, of course. Two, introduce a brand new one world currency that is 100% gold backed. This new savior currency would annul all public debt. All previous loans, mortgages and debts would be wiped off. See the Nasara Jasara program. This new currency would initially be a physical cash currency, but this time backed by the world's gold reserves. This money would already have been printed and waiting to be rolled out to the central and local banks of the world. Everyone on earth would be offered or given a stimulus starter allowance of this new currency via their local government, provided they are safely vaccinated and microchipped, of course. This new one world cash currency would slowly transition into a digital one world cryptocurrency over the next 12 to 18 months. Of course, the masses would celebrate and welcome these changes as it would appear a win-win situation for everyone. I would roll out this first phase between January and April of the year. I would announce 
the launch of my new One World Currency during the first week of April, as this is already the world's accepted start of the financial tax year. Phase 1 completed. April, May and most of June would be recovery months to allow my new financial system to infiltrate the commercial, psychological and socio-economical system of the world. These three months would also be grace periods to allow the masses to get their vaccinations and antivirus nanochip IDs. Then, at the end of June, during the solstice week, I would begin phase two of my plan.